One, two, three, fuck it. Well, hello everyone. Welcome back. I am Anna. And today we're going to be reacting to the fourth episode of the fourth season of What We Do in the Shadows. So this season has started hot and ready. It has been so fucking funny up until right now. Um, you know, this, this show just is doing it like nothing else out there right now. And I am so fucking excited and happy for it. Now, let's jump in and let's see Colin Robinson being the star of the show, shall we? Business is booming at the nightclub, baby! The only real problem, apart from the blood sprinklers clogging yet again, is the fucking employees. How many of our patrons have died in race-related accidents in the last week alone? Five. What? Five! But, you know, four of them were human. Yeah, okay, that's not so bad then. But yes, but you do make them sleep in the supply closet. Well, it is better than sleeping in the streets. You can remind them of that. Me? Are they intentionally underperforming in order to get their way? You know, it does seem like they've organized some sort of labor action. This, I know how to handle. Oh. <laughs> Kill them all! Uh, I forgot the words, Laszlo. <laughs> what is this Tom... He's low. What about this one? Rumpelstiltskin. Rumple Dickskin, more like. You know that's how he got his name, this chap? Doesn't say that in the book. What's Dickskin? So you will be meeting with Xerxes? We require more than one break a day so that we may haunt the descendants of our transgressors. We would all like to have more time for our hobbies. <clears throat> I have given you and your weird, faceless friends a job and a lovely warm supply closet to sleep in. Without me, you... That went well. I think that's supposed to be a joke. <sighs> All right, I'll tell you the real story. Some third-rate cobbler, ripped to the tits on formaldehyde fumes used in his leather tanning process, imagines he's seeing little elves do all his work. Loses his business, kills himself. The end. It is truly the only place where we can set aside our differences and work towards a common goal. To fuck the other guy before he fucks you! <laughs> it's just a work thing. Okay. I'll call you later. I love you. What do you require? We want to meet him, Guillermo! Show him to us! For someone like me to go, meaning as a human? I don't care. Yeah, do not worry, Guillermo. You're a hunter. If anyone asks, just you're not say you're an orc human. or some shit. Well, I don't look like an orc. Do I? <laughs> I am very excited for this trip as well. Yeah, Even I though we live her. in the same house, it's so rare that Nandor asks me along when he has an outing with his friends. So, you know what? It changed my mind. Nice I think I'd rather just to stay home. Oh no, Mawa, this is a big fat bummer I am hearing. But okay, fine, I miss you already. Yeah, bye. I want more time with her. Sometimes it's just more fun to hang with just the boys. With Guillermo? Oh, wow. Talent right there. If you're still here, you know why you're here. Next stop, the night market. Oh, dear. Yeah. Oh, he was fantastic. Are you still <laughs> Not for Luckily, I come from a long line of highly skilled hagglers. My yaya, she once traded just a little bit of her thigh meat for a whole bag of onions. So, yeah. I think I know what I'm doing. Valkyries are a group of maidens who were sent by the gods to the Viking battlefields so they could choose- I literally just watched Thor last week. I literally just grabbed this from Nando's room before I left the house. Fairies are pretty little women that can fly around and they live in mushrooms. Really, I like this story. Hello, my beauties. Laszlo! You're looking <laughs> healthy. Your basket. Oh, sorry. What human dare mingle amongst us? I, I'm not a human. Uh, I'm an orc. <laughs> My mistake. Have a good one. What? What is this? This is the familiar fights. Wait, what? I haven't been to one of these in ages. Yeah. Basically, a vampire will say, I have the toughest familia. And then another vampire will be like, no, my familia is even tougher. And then they get the oh familiars to fight each God. other. It would never yeah. I think we should break the army. Break this army! Don't break this army. Oh. That's nothing. In the old I think I want to do that. Yeah. 
right it is, because you could take any of these guys. That's besides hey! the point. This vampire here thinks that his familiar can beat any of our familiars. Oh! <laughs> no. Is the little guy scared? Fight no. a fucking vampire. Master. The only thing my oh, familiar is scared of is beating all of your familiars all at once, because that's how tough my familiar is. Okay, he wants it. He wants it. He wants it. He wants it. He's going to get it. You're going to get it. He's gonna crush all of them. He's gonna fucking destroy them. This is not a fair fight. I gave the vase and then they gave me their rarest delicacy, the little meatballs in the brown water. I don't know why Valkyrie said the little tiny meatballs. I traded with the imps because the imps love tiny foods. <laughs> that was nice! Are you okay? Fucking guy! That's my fucking guy! Let's have another fight. Hopefully he dies. For instance, that Pinocchio there. Whoa. See his nose? Don't stare. It's just a medical condition. It's got bugger all to do with lying. Oh. As far as I know, he was never a puppet. And sometimes, grown-ups lie to children because the truth is just so boring. Okay. And behind him is a witch. They're very real. And one day they'll fight to get hold of your semen. Oh. But not in a fun way. What semen? We don't have to do this, okay? We're both familiar. Come on. So why don't we just shake Be a badass, Guillermo. I'm just trying to talk to you like a regular person. I love him so much. Now our familiar is having an asthma attack. Is there a doctor? Is someone a doctor? Somebody? We're not hurting anyone today. It's sort of infinite and it has dark, dirtier sides. Bit like me. <laughs> Would a cop have this? A piece of clothing with a very misogynistic joke that makes a complete mockery of common traffic safety laws. <laughs> <laughs> the time it took him to read it. This is up your alley. We have a deal. Take the stupid shirt. What is that? What is that? And as a reward, well, we all know humans love some dried up dog food. They love that shit. They love it. And now it is time for our main event. Our champion familiar oh, versus our champion vampire, Gorgo the Murderer. <laughs> Look at him. I am murdering so fucking hard. The timing of this show. That joke wouldn't have been so effective without the dog food. I swear. He's a vampire. Now remember, I'm a vampire killer. Oh yes, I was forget that. Okay then, go kill him! Go kill him! Go kill him! Go I think I have an idea. You leave? Run. No. Vampire! Is he gonna fight? Is he gonna fight? A fight between this poor familiar? My closest companion for 13 years? Against this ruthless vampire? This is sick! This is... Sorry, but I just... This is sick! This is sick! Okay, now, what would be even more sick? What? A battle between him and me! Who wants to see me pulverize my closest companion of birthday? Who wants to see me... What? It's implausible it would take any longer than five seconds for me to beat you. Mm, is it though? I mean, remember last time? Okay. Oh, he's gonna kick your ass now, Nander. He's gonna fucking destroy you. Whoa, we got stakes. We got stakes. Yo, chicken, he goes, shit, come here. He killed my friend. What the fuck? That was what <laughs> Stop throwing stakes in. Guillermo is so fucking cool. I don't know what to tell you. He is so fucking cool. Is this still part of the game? <laughs> this is not a game anymore, Guillermo. Oh, oh god. Oopsies. I killed my friend. 
I may have killed my friend. Not yet, bitch. I'm not there yet, bitch. They are right here, man. Finish me. He cannot do it. Just like pretend to snap my neck or something so we get the hell out of here. This is a much better plan. We went to the night market last night. Oh my, the night market. What fun. Mm. I already had plans last night, so it's a good thing I didn't get invited. And he I cannot remember the last time someone got me a gift. You have detected this sweet, intoxicating scent of the water lily of the Nile, haven't you, Xerxes? Uh oh. Do I have enough of these to give to all of the wraiths? No. Do I have enough of these to give to the one wraith who tells all the other wraiths what to do? Maybe. I think that is probably all I need. Don't you? <laughs> don't do it. Boss says, bitch. I don't oh. Oh. oh, no. Shit, shit. Fine. Fuck it! You can have Mondays off with pay, and I will build you five new supply closets for you to sleep in. <laughs> I know you've had a disappointing day, so no rehearsal tonight. No, that's okay. I don't think I want to read those anymore. That's so fucking sad. So, here in Mexico, the Guillermos, we call them as a nickname, we, we call them Memo. Memo, like... Memo. And so Memo here was quite a pretty human, wasn't he? I absolutely love all of that scene with Nandor and you know the familiar fightings and all of that. That was fucking amazing. <laughs> Knowing that Guillermo could kick his ass in a second and refrain, that was that was beautiful. <laughs> Colin Robinson and Laszlo's kind of little moments of family you know the father and son kind of um are so cute they are so fucking cute. since the beginning of the season since the very beginning they are they have been so so cute well that was a great episode another great episode all right guys so this was it for today's video i hope you liked it tell me how you feel about it in the comments down below i love hearing from you thank you very much for joining me have a great day and i'll be seeing you around